welcome back to While You Were Two Learning How To Spell Your Name! I was being trained to read creepypastas! I've got to say, did not see that one coming. <laughs> We're reading you, Chan, which was requested by Mike Signorelli. Oh, for fuck's sake, you say it. Well, I ain't got my glasses. Why are you giving it to me? Mike Signorelli, is that? Yeah, probably. Sigourney Weaver, there you go, that's your name. Curiosity always gets the better of me, and I'm not the only one. How do you think online videos like Three Guys One Hammer, Two Girls One Cup? Are... Okay, th you can't really compare those two. No. One is two <clears throat> willing participants doing something gross for money. The other is a hideous, despicable murder. And various gore videos get so many views. Everybody wants to see it. You do too. I've never watched Three Guys One Hammer because it's I a hideous, despicable was. murder. I didn't even know what that was until uh, you just mentioned it. I could. You know, has the guess. Yeah, to be honest, I could. Not only have I never watched it, I could do without knowing it even exists. You know, I'm a, I'm a huge fan of One Mat One Hot Dog. <laughs> it's, it's just me. <laughs> that look, he just went. It's just me eating the hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's a gore video, though. Be warned. My story starts in the time when I got in some kind of depression at age 18 that started after my father passed away. Oh my god, English! This guy has such a wonderful grasp of the language. I didn't go to school or work for about a year. I had seas of time and spent most of it on the internet. <laughs> Rather than the Prince of Persia sands of time! No way because could turn back and not be such a fucking weeaboo. The only thing that would really cheer me up were anonymous image boards. Oh, you mean 4chan! You we were right! That's like, no one who goes to 4chan is ever happy. <laughs> yeah, like, 4chan cheers up no one, except psychopaths. Unless that's the point, that's the punchline of the story. Okay. These are the only places where people's true nature comes out. I fucking hope not! <laughs> I hope 4chan isn't representative of our true nature. <laughs> <coughs> Full of racial slurs and monster girl porn. Monster That's the true <laughs> nature of mankind. It's why I want to see, this... see an anime centaur's tits. It's why we were put on this earth. But so Return of the overfiend. But just so long as it's white. <laughs> Fuck 4chan. Can't do any of those darky monster girls. <laughs> Also, I loved getting a good laugh once in a while. Can you ever really go to the right place? I have been able to talk about how shitty my life was, and dozens of people showed up actually feeling the same. No, probably if you're it wasn't. There's no way. There's, I, like, it I'm must sad. be somewhere else. He must have found another image board. There's no way it was 4chan. <laughs> yeah. Because I've my, I'm go, depressed. Lol, and killing my, himself. Yeah, and my dad died, and I've spent the year off. I can't imagine anything positive coming out putting that on the internet. Fucking hell. It felt like friends, even though I didn't you know any about them. You lazy scrub, kill yourself, low, drink the bleach, faggot. <laughs> Matt is a frequent poster on 4chan. <laughs> I started to love dark humour. I can't imagine uh, what that must be like for someone. If something terrible happened, I love to instantly make jokes and Photoshop out, Photoshop's out of it. Wait, oh, wait, great. so your dad dies and you get depressed, so you go on the internet seeking, you know... Um, Solace, like yeah. comfort. And then when something bad happens to someone else, you're immediately like... -la 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 -la. So did my anonymous friends. Feels a bit wobbly. Some say you change if you spend too much time on image boards. And I think those people are right. My depression got worse as a result. And I only spent even more time on image boards. My sense of humour got darker. Oh, boo hoo. I can only get cheered up by terrible trolls and raids. Fucking what are you? I called people, giving them death threats, and posted the results on the internet. God, that's so fucking funny, isn't it? Yeah, what a. What a uh, that's, that's hilarious. I can One, see your sense of humour went from, you know, things that are, laughing at things that are funny to. I don't know, I, that's like the opposite of funny. Yeah. Like Dane Cook. Yeah, it's. <laughs> Or well, Big Bang Free, anti-funny. One time I even called up an airport with a bomb threat disrupting plane trips for thousands of passengers. Aren't you a <laughs> wonderful person? Then the FBI person? came round and uh, I think Guantanamo Bay. Yeah, they would be able to trace your call if you made a fucking call like that, I don't know. <laughs> of course my internet friends thought it was hilarious because of pieces of shit. Um, at this point, I wasn't on the normal part of the internet anymore. The image boards were obscure boards on the deep web. Google it if you don't know what it is in quote deep brackets. Web. 
Ooh, spooky. He had. He didn't use Google. He had the onion router. Just, oh, he, he used Alta Vista, which I don't yeah. think exists anymore. Yeah. But if anyone doesn't know, like, deep, what the deep web sounds like is, oh, it's some sort of secret dark. No, it's just the bits of the internet that Google doesn't usually take you to. Yeah. It's just like the unpopular bits. Yeah, it's just the shit internet, basically. Mm. So the 1995. If you've ever seen a deep web page, it basically looks like a 1995 web page. <laughs> little flame skulls. Yeah, the pretty corner. much. <laughs> like, it looks uh, not unlike the creepypasta wiki with its fucking delightful white on black that is just a pleasure for your eyes. You can have it on white. You can have it on black and white if you want. Fucking do that. Oh, white on black. It's already on black and oh no, white on black. Oh, I see. So you want me to change it to to light instead of dark? Yeah. Oh god, my eyes. Well, that's kind of worse because of the font they've chosen. Yeah, that is bad. Oh, is Comic Sans. Let's undo that. You need to get some more glasses. When are you getting glasses? Yeah, I'm supposed to have a fucking. The two artists I'm supposed to have both came during filming, so I had to cancel them. Oh. Anyway. <laughs> your eyes, boy. This way, people could post. Terrible illegal content, completely anonymous, without even a traceable IP address. Uh, that's not how that works, but okay. No limits whatsoever. Um, I can tell you what, guys. Everybody, if, if I tell you what, author, why don't you yeah get tour or something like that, and, and try um going out and engaging in terrorist activities and all sorts of things on the deep web and see where it gets you. <clears throat> Agreed. My where, craving f where it gets you, present, being yeah. bombed, vigorously. Yeah, we're not talking about normal prison. We're talking deep, dark <laughs> super prison. We're talking, yeah, this ain't the normal the internet. Super jail. Yeah, this, these aren't normal internet crimes. These are deep web crimes. You got a deep web jail. Yeah. <laughs> my craving for disastrous content got greater and greater. I couldn't control my craving, for it was the only thing that could satisfy any part of me. My craving for Kellogg's Crave. <laughs> Wait, don't bring what? up cereal when you go on the fucking rant again. Which, hang on which a by the way, which by the way is nowhere near as nice as all the cheap cereals that have been doing what Crave is for years you know when Crave was like new and it was like oh this amazing exciting like cereal it's like a little pillow with chocolate inside they've been making those in like little for about 25 years and they're way way nicer than fucking Kellogg's Crave it's a rip off but you is it Kellogg's can. or Nestle who cares fuck one, of, the, fuck? one of those cunt just as long cereal as you companies don't use a plate <laughs> yeah just so long as you eat it out of a bowl unlike Frosty's kid what I want to know is what makes Special K so special whatever happened to Normal K like special Steve or someone like that. Like you don't necessarily have to have a friend who's just normal Steve. I guess, but normal K. I mean, I've got to have the comparison. Regular I don't K. know what makes special K so special. It's the if ketamine. there's no normal, it's the ketamine. Right? Okay, let's go. <laughs> you think make it in a big lead bowl? My days were basically staying home to browse the web for gore and illegal content till the early morning. You Great. Sound, you sound like a cunt. You sound what? like a, a real fucking why? party animal. How yeah. the fuck are we going to feel sorry for you when bad stuff starts happening to you in the story? The best or rather worst image board was Disaster Chan. Here we go. There were people probably just like me. Obsessed and addicted to violence, rape and murder. Aren't you a lovely piece of shit? Sometimes an actual killer would show up and show their work. You mean... Jeff? Book him? Jeff Royd? Right, one time a guy posted his own kid, blah, 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 blah. That's disgusting. It made my day. I was addicted to violence. It was like a drug. I needed a bigger dose every day. If you Whoa, want... I just fucking read what you glossed over. Yeah. yeah what I... the fuck? Yeah, it's pretty horrible, yeah, isn't it? I'm glad I can't see it at this angle. Mm, it's pretty horrible. That's why I glossed over it. My desire for gore got so big, not even Disaster Chan could, wait, could wait, satisfy me that... anymore. He, he gave him a cake and a cuddle? <laughs> Oh man! <laughs> and then he's gonna grow up to be an astronaut, you fucking piece of scum! Fuck like Jeremy Kyle all over. Scum! <laughs> Put something on the end of it. After another day of pointless browsing, I couldn't find my daily do my I couldn't find my daily shot of violence. It's fucking heroin now. I made a thread asking why I couldn't get satisfied anymore. Well, maybe because you haven't got a fucking dick. Only one guy reacted, posting a link to another Chan. It was Chan. Super murder, Chan. I copied the link and F5 the page. My the, my post was gone. This was rather strange because threads never get deleted since nothing is extreme enough for this site. When I tried extreme. When I tried to post again, it said I got perma ban with no reason addressed. It made me angry. Oh, boo! Fucking ho! Why the hell ban me for making a thread like this? Was it because I had complaints about the site? Oh, fuck off! Despite my anger, I realised I had. That other chan on my control V, you mean copy and paste, it was another dot onion link. You were right, it's the fucking onion. It was onion, whatever. 
that was only accessible from an untraceable IP. You trying to sound edgy, it's not fucking working, is it? The site had completely black layout. There was no picture in the center above like most image boards. Even the text was black, so I had to select all the text to be able to read it. So it's exactly like normal porn for normal people.com then. Yeah. The image board was called youchan.com. <laughs> Funchan.com. Yeah. At first I thought it was pretty stupid name and possibly another YouTube ripoff. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking YouTube. I mean, God, at least YouChan pay their people. <laughs> 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 I wanted to close the site when I realized I had nothing better to do and might as well browse this obscure board for a while. There was only one news article posted on the homepage. The time I posted was five minutes ago today. It said, welcome to YouChan. On the left side of the image board was different boards listed. Uh, Necro, I'm sure you can understand what that's for. Uh, Sem for cemetery and B random. <laughs> right. Great. I'm used to like when I go to a website, a Necro is when someone's reposting in an old thread. Not that, I'm not expecting that. <laughs> not many boards. Most image boards have about 20 or more. B was a board most sites like this have. It was Sem and Necro that caught my attention. I had never seen actual, and I could uh, only guess that Sem would have pictures and advice about digging up great. Um, <clears throat> this is disgusting. This is horrible. Fuck me. Let's go on. I decided to visit Sem first. After the page loaded and I scrolled down, I instantly froze. I felt fear for the first time in months. Why? The only this fear wasn't amusing or satisfying way. I felt a cold shiver going up my spine. Ice cold sweat broke out. I saw a picture of my father's corpse lying next to his grave. Okay. I thought for sure it was him. I recognized his clothes. We buried him in and I had a grave was designed by a mother. I started to panic. I started to panic. How the fuck is this impossible? Who would do this? Well, I don't know. How about you, you piece of shit? Spoilers, I guarantee that's what it is. Yeah. A fucking guarantee. Either that or Yoshi. <laughs> Yoshi! Yoshi! Yeah, I said it. Yoshi! Yeah, you could do a better one. Fuck you. Alright, you do you do a much better um oh, to- you do a much better toad than me. Do you want me to help? Oh, hang on. Hold that and continue with this horrible piece of shit for a minute. <sighs> by, the w- need help. by the way, guys, the word Toby wouldn't say was necrophilia. Fuck off. <laughs> Having sex with Sorry. dead things. It's I was going to say dead people, but do you say- really count as a person once you're dead? Uh, I don't know. I guess not. I mean, all that, everything about you is gone. Mm-hmm. It's like you're is a part of me at the moment. I am. Um, Very philosophical. Like, t- when does person, you know, people like, when does person start? When does it end? Death. Well, that was easy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not too bothered by the word necrophilia simply because I've now seen the. Well, I say I watched it about two years ago. I've seen the film Necromantic, and uh, I can never unsee it. Well, the hell's necromantic? Is it like? One it's of those... exactly what it sounds like. Yeah, is it like one oh, of those... Is it a Twilight oh, ripoff? Is it basically a? Guy... Is it like that one where it's like, oh, it's, it's basically Twilight but with a zombie? No, it's uh, it's about. Is it about, it's about someone a guy... who falls in love with a corpse? Yeah, because it sounds. So it's the romantic version of Weekend at Bernie's. Yeah.